It is good for a man not to touch a woman. He's speaking to singles there. Nevertheless, because of sexual immorality, let each man have his own wife and let each woman have her own husband. And so Paul is saying singleness is good. Being married is good. I notice in the church, we have a tendency to treat singlehood as some second class Christian citizen. And I think it's very unfortunate. That's not the heart of God. It's not the heart of God that everybody has to be married at any given time within the church. The Bible does say in Proverbs, uh, let's see, I wrote it down. In Proverbs chapter 18, that he who finds a wife finds a good thing and obtains favor from the Lord. But that doesn't mean to not uh, have a wife or to not be married. Uh, You don't have favor with the Lord. And so to be able to have a wife and to be married is definitely a blessing from God. But Paul is going to show us in this chapter equally a blessing to be in whatever state you are, whether that's married or single. And so I think it's we have to be careful as Christians to um, not say things that the Bible doesn't say. 